Don't move like Jagger. I want to talk like Brando. Does it get any better than 1978 and then 1980 Superman movies? Now that I've under now that I've discovered the Thunderbolts project, um, this movie is making more sense. Superman. My granny told me, Grand Ford, Grand Ford. Your grandpa looked like Grand Ford. She also said, Me in USA, back in the day. But I'm going to go back. So that's hotty, hotty, hot, hot, um, Marlin. That was even after Last Tango in Paris. He really rocked it out. He, he, that movie's awesome. But I'm going to show you 19 and more of the 70s here. Oh, everything about the 70s is better. You know, we haven't progressed where, where are the, where's the brass? Where are the kids learning how to play, uh, tubas and things, saxophones, um, the music, the lights, the action. Look at how pretty the colors are of our clothing and how people move. Light, very light, very pretty. Now it's dark and morose. Um, I think that the takedown started around when Superman came about. Because think about Superman. That was 1978, and everything about the movie is superior to anything today. The look, the colors, the acting, the special effects, um, everything about Superman 1978, everything about the 70s and the early 80s was superior. Hey, guess what? When I went to uh, Hong Kong right before the riots as a tourist, some cab driver says, I know you got, I know you got me, but who's got you? That's the only English he could say, but he said, you, you, you. In a way, he was saying I reminded him of Lois Lane. Ah, uh, that was the best compliment I ever had. Look at the cars. The gleam. And when you see headlights back in those days in film, there's this amazing violet pink color that comes off of the light. Now, the only thing we've progressed is maybe there's a little bit less dog shit under our feet because the control freaks have made sure that there are dog parks everywhere so that the dogs just have to stay confined. And there's lots of dog bags. But we don't have any bags anymore. In Canada, we're not allowed to have bag one unless it's bought by something. I'm pissed off. We're living in the rabid New World Order. Oh, yeah, that was my point. At the beginning of Superman 1978, when they were jailing General Zod, those three, those three villains who showed up again in, in Superman 2, they said they were forging a new order. It's always a new order, isn't it? Whether it's the new politicians of China, it's new. Everything new is, is bad again. Everything new is always bad. Everything new is bad. Everything new. Okay, unless it's something of quality. Here we go, here's the dragon. This is Venus and Mars. In there, you should see the Thunderbolts project. Oh, look at that disco ball. The Thunderbolts project have got a wonderful, and now they took away disco. Why do you think that is? Why don't we have disco anymore? The Thunderbolts Project has a, a amazing documentary called, um, I think it's called When the World Ended, and it did end. Our sky was different. They have the most, the best theory, a unified field theory of any that I've ever heard of, and it's the most important information that we could ever possibly have, and that is the explanation of all the myths all the glyphs, all the myths and all the glyphs, all the glyphs and all the myths show the sun covered by Venus, Mars superimposed like the pupil of the eye. You got the pupil of the eye, the eye and the back. And then you got all your par patterns and your swastikas and all kinds of things because Mars keeps on traveling to Earth back and forth like like these all these 
all these uh, petroglyphs that you see are not ant people fat so from alien ancients these are not ant people or people with crazy hair these are the planets in the sky because when there was the Garden of Eden or Paradise on Earth when the uh, lion and the lamb laid down with each other etc all the planets were aligned properly we were aligned Earth everything was aligned up now everything's got all wonky because the Mars got all wonky and, and it started to uh, you know and it's you could call it Mars is the, the, the son of Venus who is the wife sister or the wife daughter of the Zeus or whatever it's all in there it's all in the Thunderbolts project symbols of an ancient sky or the end when the world ended something like that but it's very similar to Superman Superman from 78 and whatever happened why did Margot Kidder go crazy and why did he why was his uh, you know when he was jumping that horse who lifted it six inches who lifted it why why can't we have our icons why can't we have our beautiful colors and clothes why 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 why